cars parked here. We have a picnic table, we have an outhouse, fire rings. Follow me down this path. New Hampshire, you were good to us. Another beautiful good morning from us here in the van. Already got the bed put away. Some things cleaned up in there. Starting our day off with some Folgers instant coffee and a bowl of cold cereal. We have a French press, but we mistakenly did not, or excuse me, we had coffee that was ground for French press, but we left it and Walmart doesn't sell French press ground coffee, so. No dice there, but we're going to be getting some cool coffees on our, on our travels for sure. But instant coffee works. It's the job done. It's not the best, but it, it works. I'm going to make some coffee, eat some cereal, and then we are shoving out of here. Great spot, but only one night. We got to get to Colorado as quick as we can. Uh, also, I think the low was 69 last night. So we were running our fans. We have a fan up here. Plug in. We are running that all night just to keep air flowing. Um, it was it was hot for sure, but but we managed we slept both of us are feeling it today For sure from the hike yesterday both our bodies are, are feeling we're gonna do a little stretching before we leave That's about all I got to say and we're gonna do some coffee time As you can tell, we have a lot of stuff in there, so it's a bit of a tight squeeze. Hey! <laughs> hey! All right, stove set up. We'll keep our pots up here in a little stack, stack tower thing. I'm gonna use the little guy here. Up. I'm gonna use uh, the sink water just because it's the same water. Why not? Light her up. The cool thing about these pots is they're like, they're like quick heat pots. So they transfer heat really well. So they, they cook really fast. It makes them hard to cook meat and things like that on them. But for boiling water, fantastic. Here are the bowls, very nice. Two bowls, cereal. So we keep all our food in here and then in the cooler. Honey, almond flax. Honey, almond flax, kashi, go play. Or we have, we can eat Ooh, we well. do have granola as well. I'm gonna go for the, the cereal. Cereal's poured, water's boiling. Things are happening quick here at camp. Yep. We are gonna Ciao. Mm -hmm. Cheers. It's drinkable. Mm. We are all cleaned out. Also, just that's a frisbee that was already here, not ours. We're leaving it for some other lucky patron. Great sight here in the White Mountains. So far, was our favorite spot. <laughs> out of two spots so not not everywhere but at least right here in the white mountains these spots are kind of kind of regulated and maintained um so there's actually like this is like a numbered numbered site site number nine you can be here for 14 days just you know worrying about bears pack in pack out stuff like that so it's an interesting interesting thing here that some of these some of these roads have these numbered sites that you can stay at for free what a lovely spot it has been. But we are off to the Adirondacks. I know our, our I think we had already said that our original plan was to go to Green Mountain National Forest, um, but we decided to stay here for an extra night because of that big hike we did yesterday. So 
since we're really just trying to get out to Colorado as quickly as we can, we're gonna head right to the Adirondacks today. So that's what we have in store for today. Nice long drive from New Hampshire to New York, and then hopefully some more good camping. See you guys on the road. Big news, look who's driving. Hi. <laughs> New Hampshire, you were good to us. It'd be easier for me if I turn away to flee, oh. But there's something holding on. Let's go stretch some gnar! We have absolutely no cell service right now. So we are doing navigation by map. Big news, entering Vermont. So Woo! Vermont! Let's go! So hard to fade away. Update from the van. Currently cruising on 4 West in uh, Vermont. And it's just like all these cute towns, cute cafes, rolling mountains, rolling hills. Kate's killing it on the, on the wheel. Trav is snoozing on his litter box. The three of us are happy as a clam. Quick stop at one of our favorite places. The gas pump. Oil change. So Mark went into Hannaford to grab some hot dog buns and ice and something else. No, I don't remember. We have a list. Um, so that means it's story time with Kate. So we just got an oil change at Valvoline. Um, and he noticed that our license plate light was out. It wasn't actually out. The, um, the socket was just pushed up into the door. So what he had to do was take off our cedar paneling and that's the only way he could get in to see what was going on. So he was able to fix that. He took off our, all of our panels and he looked at our screws. He's like, what the hell are you guys doing? And we just said, literally have no idea. So he was an angel and he happened to have these really awesome heavy duty screws, these bolts, and he just went to town on our back doors. And now we have new bolts that are super tight fitting um really awesome super stealth uh, you have to see them look at them oof beauties um so he did that for us for free just out of the kindness of his heart which is so nice and kind and appreciated and more people need to be like duck his name is duck selfless um it's just it's really refreshing uh especially now with every everything going on in the world it's really um it gives you some hope when you come across really genuinely kind people um so it was a really great <laughs> really great the best oil chains that we've ever had um so it was really awesome we talked to him for a while uh, he happened to already have built out one van um, that he took cross country with his family to San Francisco and he's currently working on his second one um, that he's going to use to go on fishing trips with his son. So I think that's about all I have but I wanted to share with you. Um, yeah so if you have the opportunity to pay it forward do it. If you have the opportunity to help somebody and to do something for somebody, do it. We need that. See you guys. Uh, oil change done, van renovations done, food shopping done. Look who's driving now, ha ha ha. Onward we push, we are about two hours away from our camping spot tonight. First uh, real traffic slowdown. 
the Hillbilly Fun Park. What do they have? Mini golf, hot dogs, and... Well, we found a spot. <laughs> Epic. Yeah. Yeah. I'll so, rate it nine out of ten. I shouldn't be that. Only because we're not parked on the water. Check this out, guys. Car is parked here. We have picnic table. We have an outhouse. Fire rings. Big trees. Follow me down this path. Right down to this river. We're in the uh, Adirondacks in New York, and <laughs> I can't believe this really. <laughs> it's beautiful. So now we're just gonna kind of set up camp a little bit, get our chairs out, <clears throat> things like that. And then I think we're gonna come take a little swim. Uh, probably had to go uh, maybe about seven miles down a dirt, bumpy dirt road to get here to this spot, but. Sheesh. We made it. Tight squeeze in. We had to do some maneuvering to kind of get the van level and where we wanted, but. Jeez. I mean, look at this. All we eat is Oreos these days. Hot dogs over the fire for dinner. Good stuff today, Bug. Long, Long travel. Long travel. Travel. A little stressful. Yeah, a bit stressful, but. Probably took about, what time did we leave? 8.30, mm -hmm. 3.30. Took about seven hours to get here with a stop for an oil change and some food shopping. It's black fly season, people. So not only do we have our chair set up today, but also never before seen and working for the van footage, yeah. we're setting up a hammock. My mom and dad gifted us a two-person hammock as a little um, send-off gift along with the other many generous things they've helped us with, but... This is one of my favorite yeah. things Yeah, the ever. hammock's awesome. It's a two-person hammock. What's the brand? Um, em Emu. Emu. Atlas Suspension no, System. Oh, Eno. 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 Guys, I'm sorry. It's pronounced Eno, not Eno. E-no. Um, but yeah, so we're going to set this up. And then I think we're gonna take a dip and then basically just kind of chill, hang around camp, get a fire going, cook some food. Aha! I'm gonna try it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I always feel like it's gonna rip. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. How is it? Um, it's wonderful. Oh my god, I could oh my god, I could sleep here. Oh my god. Babe, you have to lie in this. Oh, and just look up. Look at the my point of view. Oh my god. It is so cool. So for, for anybody looking for a hammock, Inu makes incredible products. Can't highly recommend this hammock enough. Next thing to do, take a swim.
This is incredible. Yeah, yeah, we have our own like personal pool. You can see someone clearly kind of sectioned out this whole area and it's about three feet deep, two and a half feet deep. You can wade across the whole thing. It's incredible. It's incredible. It's like, it's honestly unbelievable. Like I, like, the fact this is all free, we're just like, Crazy, crazy beautiful. Well, time for the nightly task of collecting firewood. I found a really good piece, one. <laughs> one, Over there. one really good piece. <laughs> yeah, there's plenty of wood around. Looks like that newspaper is just gonna light up because it's so hot in there already still. Oh wow, really? Yeah, it's okay. Oh shit. Let's get that fire started. Oh, it's, mm, Come on, something there has got a light. Here we go. We're getting some. I think we're getting somewhere. I think we're getting somewhere. So we're gonna hang for a bit. We have hot dogs on deck for dinner. The rest of the night's gonna be hanging. Uh, probably some reading, photo editing, video editing. Chilling. Dad, if you're watching this, we do eat things other than hot dogs, I promise. We do, this is actually our first batch of hot dogs in a while, so. He thinks all we eat are hot dogs and dehydrated food. Mm. Not true. So we haven't done a van tour yet, but I'm gonna show you where we keep our kitchen utensils because I have to get stuff out for the hot dogs anyway. So up here, oh, it looks cute on camera, geez. Up here we have two baskets. We have things like personal hygiene stuff, toilet paper, shampoo, body wash, things like that, towels. And then here's where we keep all of our kitchen stuff and they fit perfectly, thank goodness. Get that down. So things like plates, we usually keep our bowls in here, but they're in the sink right now. Spatulas, ladle, probably never gonna use this, but we brought it just in case. I know, wishful thinking. Tongs, measuring cups, all of that. And I know I have hot dog sticks. Yes. Beautiful. Okay. Easy. Ain't a thing. Hey, you guys want to see two wieners on a stick? <sighs> fire roasted hot dogs. Is there anything better than a fire roasted hot dog? Uh, nerr. Uh, nerr. <laughs> <laughs> Time to cook some dogs. How are we looking? Great. You hear that, you hear that sizzle? Oh, my. It's actually, uh, whoa. Try to rest them right there. A bit harder than it looks. You're doing a great job, babe. Keep it up. Thank you. I'm gonna go cut some uns. Cut, cut those uns, baby. Dogs are done. Wow, mine look phenomenal. Smoky char flavor. Cheers. Cheers. Careful, it's hot, babe. Sheesh. Mm-hmm. 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 
I don't think life gets better than this. I don't. Hmm. Yeah. We're going for a little sunset swim. Guys, I mean, look at this. We just cannot get over the fact that this is where we're staying tonight. <laughs> I'm gonna actually uh, take some pictures, I think. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Make some cool pictures. In fact, right here. Picture I took. Pretty cool, right? Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> Time to get a little bit of work done. Do some video editing. Does it get any better than editing videos in the middle of the woods? I don't think so. Well, darkness has quickly fallen upon us here in the Adirondacks, and we have resided to the van. Um, I realize we actually, I don't think we've actually ever shown how we pull the bed out for bedtime. So, enjoy this. We're just gonna pull it out. And just like that, bed is out. We have bugs galore in here right now. We're doing some fly killing. Well, friends, this was another lovely day. A long travel day, but man, oh man, this spot was worth it. Worth it, worth it. Yeah. It was really, really was an awesome spot. Um, we had a great, great afternoon, great evening. Took a couple swims, ate some good food. Now it's time to get some shot. I think Kate, Kate's gonna do some reading. I'm gonna keep editing a little bit of uh, video until we both fall asleep. And I think it sounds like we're planning a hike up here in the Adirondacks tomorrow morning. Ooh, boy. That's what's going on here. I hope everyone's having lovely days wherever you are. We are having certainly some good ones here. So on that note, it's a good night here. It's a good night there. We'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Peace.